Yo, what's up guys here, GTA Pupser here, and welcome back to another brand new GTA 5 video. In today's video, we're actually going to be discussing that a certain state in the United States is considering banning GTA 5 from players playing their game, and what we know so far about this big ban, so let's get right in to today's video. So yes guys, I can't believe I'm making this video on this topic today, but this stuff is actually true. Again, it's been going around like big media sources like NBC, Fox, ABC, National News, and etc. And again, we're going to be going over two articles today from this state, actually Chicago, Illinois, that is considering banning GTA 5 from like people playing it and buying the game and more so yes let's get right into today's video so yes the first article that we're actually going to be looking at is from fox 32 chicago and it's titled illinois lawmakers want to ban grand theft auto amid spike in carjackings and they basically going to say people have been saying for mo for months now that teens are running around chicago and carjacking motorists like it's a video game but now lo local lawmakers are doubling down on that idea, saying video game Grand Theft Auto should be banned. Some of the carjacking suspects are not even old enough to drive. On Monday, a 16-year-old was charged, and days ago, two 15-year-olds were arrested and charged as well. Uh, Thurlius Ar Arlie Walker says violent video games like GTA could be influencing the young minds. They said Walker met with Illinois... State Representative Marcus Evans in January from the League Legis was drafted to amid a 2012 law preventing some games, including GTA, from being sold to children in Illinois. Different versions of GTA have been banned or censored in five different countries, but never in the United States. So yes, that's right. It looks like this uh, senator representative from Illinois is basically a guy that has been, you know, involved on, in this title band of the GTA games. As they said in that last sentence, I said that in five countries, the game has been banned. Now, this would be the first ever if this type of stuff went through that it would be banned in the United States. Now, it's not banned just yet, guys. It's just in the talks on, you know, our local media and news sources, so that's a thing. But again, this Mark Evans dude, I guess, is a representative, and he, from the legal uh, side of it, is trying to put a law to prevent games like GTA and violent ones that children cannot get involved with this. And as you see that there were people charged from this, unfortunately, carjacking games, and I think they're blaming Rockstar Games and GTA for making these kids. Now, this game is just a video game. It's not like you're supposed to go out and carjack cars in real life and say that is facts. That is not really true. Again, it's just a game, but again, these kids are thinking it's real life, and then they're uh, the lawmakers are blaming the parents on it, and again, I don't think that the parents should get blamed on this. Of course, they probably bought the game for the 15 and 16-year-olds because, again, uh, they're probably just a little underage, but again, they could have bought them themselves. But anyways, moving on to the other article on the Chicago Sun-Times, it said, Band sale of Grand Theft Auto, other violent video games, state rep says, and they basically says, while carjackings on the rise in Chicago and elsewhere, a Southside Democrat state representative has introduced a bill that would ban a sale of Grand Theft Auto and other violent games. Rep. Marcus Evans Jr. wants to amend a 2012 law preventing some video games from being sold to minors. Friday, he failed the HB 3531, which would amend the law to ban the sale of any one of video games depending on psychologic harm, including motor vehicle theft with a passenger or passenger present uh basically that's what the article says and it goes down to say a little bit more but in this article it says that marcus evans is going to file a bill like to this uh, you know their capital in chicago illinois and such that people cannot again play this game because it has motor theft and so much more to it and again just looking at these two articles i cannot believe that this senator representative 
wants to, um, you know, try to file that ban. Again, as I said in this video today already, it is just a video game. If you're going out, you know, to public and stuff and, you know, you know, uh, stealing cars, you know, out of nowhere, that is your own fault. You should be accountable for it. It shouldn't be Rockstar or GTA. Again, they just make the game. You know, a lot of people just like to play the game because it is not real life. Again, it's just a fun thing. They have other fun activities that you can do in the game like golfing, bowling, etc. and other GTAs. So again, it's just not GTA. It's the person that is actually doing it. And again, they are going to, you know, blame Rockstar on this for a lot of things. Again, I do not want to get in the political type of stance of this, you know, lawmaking because, again, some of it does have political sides to it and some doesn't. It's just, you know, what's going on here. So, again, guys, this is another developing story in hand. Again, this is all the information we have from this story regarding these two, you know, articles that have to do from the news people in Chicago, Illinois. And again, Rockstar, at this time when these articles have went up, again, probably news sources are trying to reach out to Rockstar Games for their comment. And from now, what I'm seeing, Rockstar Games has not commented to on this story. And Rockstar Games is probably thinking, why is this even going on? Why are we getting the blame for it? Again, a lot of people don't even carjack cars when they are playing this game. It's pretty much just the little kids, or the kids, I should say, that think differently. So, again, guys, I want to hear from you in the comment section down below. What do you think about GTA getting banned first ever in the United States in Chicago, Illinois? Do you think it should happen? Do you think it should not happen? Again, I want to hear from you in the comment section down below so again guys if you did enjoy today's video a like rating would be super awesome remember to subscribe to the dta pupster channel for more videos like this my name is pup here and i will see you guys in the next video peace out